Police have seized more than three tonnes of cocaine found floating in the Pacific Ocean in New Zealand's largest ever drug bust. Authorities believe the drugs worth half a billion dollars were destined for Australia. It was seized in a joint effort by the police, Defence Force and Customs. William Tariti reports. This is what half a billion dollars worth of cocaine looks like. 81 bales filled with the illicit drug arriving in Auckland yesterday. We believe we've dealt a significant blow to an international criminal syndicate's operation after we intercepted 3.2 tonnes of cocaine. This is a, um, the largest interception um, in New Zealand's history. Police, the Defence Force and Customs teamed up last week to seize the massive haul found floating in the Pacific Ocean. So the methodology here is well known across the world in terms of small ships coming, putting the product into the water and then short party boats coming to actually get it. It was found in international waters well north of New Zealand and they believe the shipment was headed for Australia. We believe there was enough cocaine to service the Australian market for about one year and this would be more than New Zealand would use in 30 years. Which could have caused a huge amount of harm. We have a method of calculating social harm. Uh, and in, on the New Zealand calculation for this, if this was coming into New Zealand communities, $9.5 billion worth of social harm. Police believe the drugs came from South America, likely Ecuador. The bales had Batman and four-leaf clover markings on them. It's kind of like in the underworld, it's like, here's my mark, you can trust me. No one has been arrested at this stage, but authorities say they're working with a number of agencies across the world to find out who is responsible for the illegal shipments. Uh, we would be optimistic of our ability to get a result there. The 3.2 tonnes of cocaine has been incinerated at a secure facility in Auckland. William Toretti, News Hub.